Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. Thanks for stopping by. Uh, today I went over to Hobby Lobby because I really love the yarn there and I wanted to get some yarns to see if they would work for plan pooling because I really haven't seen many tutorials that use yarns from Hobby Lobby. So I got this one called I Love This Yarn and the color is really awesome. It's called Kaleidoscope. So we're gonna see if that one works. I also got, I don't know if this one's gonna work, but I love this cotton. I do, I love, I love this cotton. <laughs> it's such an awesome yarn. Um, and that one is called, it's 340 Brights. And then I also got a couple Soft Secret, which I read some reviews on Soft Secret, on Ravelry, and I'm kind of confused because I really love this yarn. It does split, like they said, but I just think it's a great yarn. It's so soft. This one's called Whisper. And then I got this one by Yarn, it's yarn B, Soft Secret, Ombre, Blueberry Hill. I like the name of that one, too. And this one looks kind of innocuous, but when you pull it out, like, the color sequences are really pretty. And I think it's going to make a really cool planned pooling project and this one is called I love this yarn super soft super savings and that one's called candy stick stash which is also ooh, look at that really cool I like the name of it so which one do you think is gonna work let's unravel these and come back and we'll figure it out together okay okay so I pulled out the kaleidoscope color which is this one by I love this yarn and the color sequence is there is no real sequence actually because unless it's just super duper long but okay so there's some green or lime color green and then magenta orange blue red there's the green again and so I thought that magenta would be next, but it's not because it was after that. So this yarn will not work for plan pooling um, because also look at how much blue there is right here. It's a lot of blue. So I mean, you might be able to try it. I might try it. I don't know. But let's move on to the next okay. one. Okay. The next one we're working on here is Soft Secret Ombre, and that one's called Whisper. I think this is a winner guys okay check this out so these sequences color sequences are shorter they're probably about six or seven inches maybe um, so I laid it out in a squiggly line and we've got blue and then green yellow pink purple pink yellow green blue so we started with blue right up there so Hopefully, if it's going to work for plan pooling, um, it'll keep this sequence, and it's one, you know, blue, green, yellow. So let's go down to our blue, and let's see if it does. Blue, green, yellow, pink. Blue, green, yellow, pink. Yay! I think this one's going to work. All right, cool. So Soft Secret Ombre in Whisper is a, is a go. It's a positive. It's a yay. Okay, let's move on to the next one. Okay, so the I Love This Cotton in the Cool co uh, Candy Stick Stash, I don't think it's a winner. This one is kind of, um, the color sequences are short in some places, long in the other. They don't all have to be even for planned pooling, but um, they at least need to be consistent. And this one is kind of all over the place. You can see um, right in the middle of the green here, there's a little bit of red. And so, and then it just kind of goes on, but there's no sequence. It just kind of goes on for a really long time and doesn't really repeat. Well, here's a little bit of a repeat. There's green, light blue, dark blue, purple, green again. So we got green, light blue, dark blue, but then it's blue after that. So this one's a no, it's a nay. Sorry, I love this yarn. Okay, so the next one we're gonna do is the Ombre Blueberry Hill yarn be soft secret and I think this one's a winner I'm stoked um, this one has like the gray and then dark blue 
and then gray, blue, and then kind of a lighter blue, and then a white, and then a light blue, and then it, this is where the repeat actually, I think the repeat ends here with the white. So this one's a winner. You can put that on your list. Soft Secret Ombre Blueberry Hill. All right, the next one I'm doing here is, I love this cotton, and that's the 340 Brights. So I'm not sure if this one's going to work, but it's really cool. It starts off with this turquoise, and then it goes into kind of like an aqua, then a green, a lime green, a yellow, orange, pink, darker pink, and then a purple, and then it goes back to the blue. So it does have a sequence, and it's one, two, three, four, wait, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's a nine sequence. But the colors are really striking. They're very, it's a lot of yarn within each sequence. Um, I'm going to give it a shot. I tell you what, I'm going to do it because it's just, I love rainbows. See how that rainbow, isn't it beautiful? Okay, so this one's a maybe. All right, so it looks like we had a few winners. Soft Secret Ombre Whisper. This pattern I ended up putting in the Plan Pooling website and created a free pillow pattern that's in my blog. If you go over there and check it out, um, I'll put the link down below. And then we had Soft Secret Ombre Blueberry Hill. These are about $4.50 each, and they have quite a good yardage on them. There's some of the information. 4.5 for knitting needles. They're worsted weight yarn. I used an H hook with the pattern that I made. And so the other one that was a a maybe was this I love this cotton and that one is there you go there's some of the information there 153 yards 100% cotton which is always nice and this one I'm gonna play around with so keep an eye out because there might be a fun blog coming with that one so I hope you enjoyed this tutorial if you have any questions please leave them in the comment section below I'm happy to answer any questions. I'm kind of new to plan pooling too, so if you find any yarns that you like, um, go ahead and leave them in the comments section. I'll update the blog. And I hope you guys have a great day. Thanks for, thanks for everything and uh, keep watching. Subscribe.